Microsoft wants to save us from USB-C confusion. Beginning with Windows 11 24H2, PC makers will need to include a number of previously optional features, including DP Alt Mode, which allows you to output DisplayPort over your USB-C port, PCIe tunneling and Thunderbolt compatibility, which are um, ba basically the ability to run PCIe lanes through your uh, USB-C port, and must use Windows' built-in USB driver stack in order to be compliant with the Windows Hardware Certification Program, WHCP. The changes are meant to ensure that USB 1, 2, and 3 peripherals will just work for data transfer, charging, and display on any USB-C port on certified Windows 11 devices. Systems supporting USB 40 gigabit per second must also be fully compatible with USB 4 and Thunderbolt 3 peripherals. Device makers can make use of Microsoft's MUT USB test tool and Windows Hardware Lab Kit to ensure their devices comply. These requirements, however, don't apply to desktop PCs at this time. Overall, fun. overall, this is a W. Um, and our discussion question is, what does Microsoft gain by doing this? I get and it. I think I think they gain their computers not being super confusing. Apple computers have their confusion, like, oh, this one can support this many displays, and this one can support not as many displays. Like, they definitely have their issues. But generally speaking, the hardware for the MacBook is way less confusing to buy than the hardware for a Windows laptop. And I think Microsoft is really starting to look at the share that they've lost to Apple over the years and go, okay, holy crap, no, no. Whether it's partnerships with Qualcomm for ARM processors or whether it's you know, finding ways to reduce the friction of the Windows PC buying experience, we have got to deal with this. Yeah, I mean, uh, the Windows laptop ecosystem has always been kind of a mess um, yep. with a lot of just kind of junk in it. And I think this is a good move from Microsoft to try to clean up their space and make them look more uh, serious and professional, to be honest, because USB has been kind of gross for a long time now. Like USB-C is just very annoying to deal with. Um, and yeah, I think, I think it's a good move, to be honest. 